The only thing in life guaranteed to us is death. That sounds morbid, and I know saying that makes me sound like I'm trying to sound like I'm a stoic. Trust me, if you saw the way I use my free time, you would know that I'm the polar opposite of a stoic. I like to be one, but I'm not. Really, I care about people's attention. I care about strangers' attention. That's why I make YouTube videos. I could make videos and just share them to my friends, but no. I put them publicly online, I, I tag them, I make a nice thumbnail to get strangers approval. I, I, I care I care about what other people think about me and I know that's not right because whenever I ask myself, why do I care about what other people think? Why does that matter? At the end of the day, doubt, like no matter what you do with your life, you're gonna die. And when you die, no one else's opinion about you matters. It doesn't matter if I get a million people to say, he was a good person that guy right there that dude that's a good person that doesn't matter that's not going to define where i end up that doesn't actually define my success and that makes me question what do we think matters that doesn't matter we're constantly being lied to about the things that do matter the masters quote unquote of the world do everything in their power to mislead us but the truth is deep inside I think all of us know that the only thing that matters is what we do and our intentions when we do them. Do them. Video games, movies, porn, music, food, it's all a distraction. Because if they can get you to focus your attention away from yourself and what's really important, that's all they need to do. We're told to go for more, that success looks like collecting more material items, but they have it all wrong. Success is about stripping away the BS you add. The only destination is death, and how you enter death is the only thing that matters. Your designer clothing, your IG followers, your bench press PR aren't going to prepare you for that destination. And these aren't original ideas at all. Really smart people, people way smarter than me, have been thinking about these kinds of things way before me. It's actually part of a philosophy called Stoicism. And basically a bunch of Greek dudes were like, life is suffering, might as well stop complaining about it. Death is the only reality. It's the only thing you know is real. Your dreams, your aspirations, relationships don't amount to when you get shot in the head. You have power over your own mind, not outside events, and how you react to what the world throws at you. Realize this, you will find strength in it, which is why you need to focus on death because it reminds you of your life. It reminds you of what is important. You are here for a limited amount of time, and what you do with that time is up to you. But while you're here, the entire time you're being distracted, by a million different things asking for your attention and more than half of them don't matter yo if you like this do the you know do the thing like the video share whatever um check out my podcast check out my instagram check out all the things that don't matter but kind of matter to me i put a lot of time into my videos whenever i do make them and whenever i'm not making videos it's usually because i'm busy on the podcast i work on with my best friend so if you're into talking about Whatever the heck you want to talk about, come join the Thoughtful Banter podcast. Make sure to support it on Spotify. We're, we're like on, on all streaming platforms, but yeah, check it out. See you guys later. Peace out.